This is our final round robin session of the LGT World Women's Curling Championship. A Take a look at the highlights here from the first half. Start off in the third end and Scotland has a chance here. Yeah, nice chance for two and actually uh, Team China had two or three double chances but just couldn't get it. So leaves a, a hit and that is two points for 2-1 lead at that point. And we go to the next end, the fourth end, and China had been looking like they were in trouble here, Kevin. Yeah, Eve was just a little heavy on her last and through the, she wanted to throw a guard, end up coming in and locking a corner and giving a potential double here, but this gets extremely close to the guard, but the sweepers get it by. That's a big one point to tie the game when it looked like uh, Team China might give up one or two. And then to five and Again, a chance here for a couple for Scotland. It was a great end. Eve on her first made a terrific thin double and held the shooter as a biter. Han Yu then tries a double, actually makes contact with both, but hangs it on the back 12 foot. So draw for two. Two it is, four to two really nice. at the half. And highlights from the second half of our game here in the sixth end. and. Uh, Eve Muir had tried to come around to put a little bit of pressure on China and just a little bit short and this leaves a opportunity for a hit and stick and a score of two. And they just get by the top guard but clip their own and their shooter rolls a little too far. They only score one. And now here in seven in Scotland in trouble this end. Needs a hit and stick for a single and rolls a little bit, but it does just hang on just for the single. And to the eighth end and uh, some missed Chances by Scotland leaves this open draw for a big three for China. And no problem. They will put three on the board and take that momentum forward as they force Scotland to one in nine and now have to draw full four foot here in 10 for the win. On you. Cool under pressure. Sweepers manage this and they drag it to the forefoot, and that is the win for China over Scotland. So, Marco, yes. six and seven. Yes. Uh, I guess I'd like to hear your thoughts on finishing off with a big win in this women's championship. Yeah. We are very happy about the last game because uh, for me it's very important uh, the way you finish the competition and uh, we, 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 we do a good job from my point of view and uh, we beat uh, Hebe, it's not easy, <laughs> but uh, we are very happy about that. You know, with a young team and especially a young skip, yeah. having this great performance at this World Championship, how does that make you feel going into, of course, next year in Beijing Olympics? Yeah, you know, we... Uh, we have do a selection in China, and uh, we do the, we see a lot of player. We have a good player, and uh, we we trust uh, our uh, way for curling, and uh, we push a lot on the physical performance, not just curling and just uh, curling skill. And uh, Han have uh, both of that uh, skill, and uh, she is very good in curling, and she is very good athlete to play curling. Yes, well, I, I also agree with that. Well, thank you very much. Appreciate You're it. You're welcome. Thank you.